Friday's independent now. How hard can it be to become a British citizen? Josh, firstly, I had to. Uh, did you did you ever have to get over any hurdles already? No, no, well, no. <laughs> <laughs> British born and raised, but I do have a, a family member who had to do this test recently, and it is ridiculous. Yeah. This is in the Independent, but yeah, they have to uh, fix it. There's a report that's sort of come out, but there have been some of the questions are so silly, like some that no one would ever know, like where the founder of the UK's first curry house eloped with his wife. I don't see how anybody could possibly know the what? that. Where did the founder of the UK's first curry house elope with his wife? Was it Spain? I don't know. I'm, not, I guess I'm, not don't, that don't place up on the Scottish border. No. Where they, what was that? Oh, Gretna yeah, Green. Gretna Green. Yeah, Gretna but it wouldn't Green. be there. Look, I, it? I, 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 yeah. You know what? It's wow. a, better, a better person than I would have actually looked that up. <laughs> <laughs> but so the, it's like but, a pub quiz sort well, of. Well, so that's what they're saying. But then there are some questions that are quintessentially British, which I actually think sh like, should be in there. Like, well, like <laughs> you know, what do you do when someone spills your pint, or when you spill someone's pint? I feel like that is those sort of questions. I'm like. That is that is the essence of Britishness or whatever. But then, of course, someone it's might also get some... slightly like the Blade Runner replicant questions. Well, it is you know? because it's obviously going to be in different parts of the country. And yeah. if they've seen Train Spotting, they're going to have a very different answer <laughs> <laughs> to my life. <laughs> well, if they've read Sid the Sexist, in yeah. 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 What would you do? What would you? What would your answer be to that? I'm not sure. I mean, in, spill in, someone's pint. Well, in, I think if your pint is spilt or you spill someone's pint yeah. in England, you've got to apologise. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody yeah. apologises yeah. all Either the time. Way. If you get your spill or the other way around, yeah. you're going to apologise. Eye contact yeah. and a sincere apology and then and then assess whether or not this yeah. is going to escalate. And yeah. 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 Do that. I'm sorry that you spilled my pint. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but, they, but they do need to do something about uh, just ensuring that, that people who take citizenship um, you know, embrace Western liberal democratic values of equality yeah. and tolerance and... Not forming a grooming gang or committing any terrorist I attacks. Totally agree, just yeah. Some of that stuff, because you know, some of that stuff goes on. And uh, although there's not a lot on the grand scheme of things, I don't, yeah. I don't like any of it. I suppose the point is, you can ask, you can ask somebody questions like, which I did do it. There's a, there's a thing you can do, like a mock exam online. So I did try a few, and one of them, for instance, was which of these is not a British value? Uh, one of them was. Uh, uh, f fairness, one of them was respecting people's, uh, other people's opinions, and then one of them was driving a car. And so driving a car is not a British value. OK, so that's fine. But just registering that those are British values doesn't mean that you're going to uh, be able to internalise them, does it? I think there is a possibility there that it's kind of, well, that's done, he passed the test, you know. I think, yeah. they, I think that what they should do is be forced to watch GB News, yeah. Their eyes open, like yes. you know, like chain into the chair, in, or yeah, 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 like that. In a queue, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You've got to learn how to queue. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I totally agree with that. And, and not oh, yeah. being able to queue is actually infuriating, even though yeah. we laugh oh, at queue, yeah. queue, the queues as a sort of quaint old British custom. That is mm -hmm. fair play in action, absolutely. That would be like the equivalent of the dog barbecue in well, the replica. Well, maybe it'll be that they queue up to get the. The test, yeah, and that's the that's the test yeah. itself. I like if they thinking. stay in the yeah. if they stay in the queue and in. people try and push <laughs> in. What do people say? Yeah, yeah. anyway, well, nice. you're welcome. <laughs>